All right, guys, it's Warren Cliff Wednesday, and today we got another blade that was sent to us by Doom Crew Outdoors. So, guys, be sure you go over, check out his channel. He has sent me some excellent pieces to check out here lately. We did some swapping, and we're going to be doing some more swapping, but he wanted to send me some blades to check out. This is one of uh, four excellent stag pieces he sent my way. And I figured I'd better shoot this and make me a Warren Cliff Wednesday video with this bad puppy. If we look, we got this stag. We got case double X here, kind of in the uh, in the written in the stag or scrolled in the stag, however you want to say it. But this is part of the Rancher series knives that he has gotten. Um, he's got the matching um, sow belly stockman for it as well. Now I'll tell the story. Because many people ask, how do he get these? Well, he got them off Instagram, and he paid $60 for both knives. I don't know how or who had it for sale, but he paid $30 a piece for these. Now, this knife alone right here is $200 all day. $200 all day long. Popcorn stag, sow belly. I, I don't understand. <laughs> then you got this matching one to go with it. Both are... CV blades. Both are, I believe, 2011. We got nine, uh, we got stars and dots, or X's and dots. We got nine of them, so I'd make it a 2011 blade, I believe. Look at the blade centering on that puppy. She is a strike three, right down the middle. Look at the stag. Smooth transition. Look at this. Look at the back spring on this. And how many single blade mini trappers with a Warncliffe do you see out there? You don't see many. I just found this one. It's not mine, but we look at the model number 5107W. W stands for Warncliffe. Five lets you know it's stag. One is the number of blades. 07 is the designation for mini trapper. USA CV, everyone knows the CV is that carbon steel. Man, look at that thing. And uh, I got a regular mini trapper here to kind of compare it to, but it's a whiskey bone. I got her all oiled down. <laughs> but what I wanted to do is um, let's just open these up and, and look at them compared to one another. You know, you get your regular clip point on the uh, one on top, and then you got your warning down here on the bottom. And the stag makes her sit kind of off kilter, but. Just two completely different knives, in my opinion. Um, out of the two, which one are you choosing? It is a tough decision. You got the whiskey bone on top, but you can't beat stag. You, you just can't do it. I don't care what you say. You cannot beat stag in a knife. And the fit and finish on this thing, too, is just, it's phenomenal. And the stag matches up pretty good. Or a lot of case knives, you know, from front to back, just don't match extremely well sometimes. This one here is a pretty decent example of one that does. But what I wanted to do also, um, I want to weigh them, kind of see what the difference is in weight. And do crew send me that cigar up there too. So we'll start with the Warney here. We'll put her on the old ounces. See what she weighs ounce wise. 1.75 ounces this is going to be a lot heavier 2.55 so kind of a big difference in the two you know you look at the let's get that out of the way so it's not shining back into the camera but you look at the the width in these as well a lot more pocket friendly over here get more work done with this this is cv as well which i greatly enjoy i forgot how i got this oh i got this off lee out at the flea market 60 bucks i paid for that i paid 60 for this doom crew gave 60 for both of these now tell me what kind of sense that makes <laughs> just tell me oh it doesn't in it but you know you got to appreciate a man who searches for a good deal and pulls the trigger when he knows to pull the trigger you just can't beat situations like that you know i wish i was him in that situation but i'm not and here's here's a warning i carry all the time quite frequently this is a trade i made with boston blade reviews he sent me a brand new american workman copper lock 
for, I forget what I traded him for. Oh, it was a uh, 110, a buck 110 special build out. But there's a difference in those two blades. You know, look at the measurements here and fully open the copper lock on top, fully open. She starts at six, goes to 13 and a quarter. So she's seven and a quarter inches long open. Well, your mini trapper here is gonna be six and a quarter, about six and a quarter, somewhere in that area. So you got a full inch difference in the two, blade wise, you know, kind of look at how the blades, yeah, about half an inch difference in the blades. But it ain't about this one, it is a Warren Cliff, but this video is about this piece right here. We're gonna make this a short video today. I got tons of stuff to do. I got family in town. Um, I am working today. It is Wednesday, but uh, I shot this on Tuesday. Don't tell anybody. Then I got my, I got my mother and sister here now, and my son and his daughter and his wife's coming tonight or early Thursday morning. So we're gonna have a good little family dinner here at the Big J household. SD Leatherworks is in there cooking right now, getting everything ready. Her and my mom and my sister. And I probably go to the Amish country today as well, so I don't know. Got my days all confused. I'm shooting this on Tuesday, releasing on Wednesday. I'm off on Tuesday, but I got to work on Wednesday. It doesn't make a lot of sense, but it is what it is. Again, I want to thank Doom Crew for sending this fine piece over. Guys, go like and subscribe to his channel. And don't forget about Happy Hour Live Chat. This weekend, we're going to have uh, Tim School of Fish on showing those... Uh, very good knife company fixed blades out of Georgia. So guys, tune in for that. You won't be uh, you won't be disappointed. You got plenty of blades to give away. It's uh, 5:30 Eastern, 4:30 Central on Sundays. All right, guys, have fun out there.